Hello. Now let me narrate the story of Kanjikuri Panchayat. Today, well known all over Kerala for its organic cultivation of vegetables. Now, as you can see, this is uh, not a uh, vegetable country. The sandy tract is not suitable for uh, agriculture at all. In fact, according to the census, hardly 10% of the population is involved in agriculture. And here, in the mid-1990s, the Panchayat President Sodhendriam, uh, he had a bright idea. Why not start a campaign for cultivation of vegetables? Not for commercial purpose, but he said that everybody should cultivate at least some vegetable in the house. Now, from right from the beginning, it has emphasized that they will not use any artificial fertilizer, they will not use any insecticides, pesticides, and so just organic cultivation on a very, very small scale. One of my students who did an thesis here, and the calculation found if you take imputed value of labor, it was a loss-making proposition. But it did, became, did become a major matter of prestige to undertake cultivation. That was the intensity of the campaign. But then, after some time, some of the people began to join together, lease in land and cultivate on a commercial scale. And it had a ready market they found because it was organic vegetables. And the highway, they opened a store, Panchayat, uh, PDS, Panchayat Development Society opened a store. And uh, all the surplus here could be sold there at a premium price. And soon other stalls began to come up. And you find now if you travel between Shartale and Alepi, at least two dozen stalls selling organic vegetables at a premium price. And therefore, they became this commercial cultivation spread to neighboring panchayats also. And this whole area is by and large self sufficient in vegetables. And you find many people specializing now fully in agriculture. This farm is owned by Subhagation, who is well known for his uh, as a seller of seeds. Uh, of course, he, he produces vegetables for the market, but he specializes in seed production. There are many educated young people who take to full-time farming. And farming today has become an important subsidiary occupation of the workers in choir industry. So this is a, story, a successful story. It's a sustainable story. Today, you don't need a campaign. You don't need prompting. It has become part of the life of Kanjukuri and Mairarikulam to cultivate vegetables.